Hello there, I'm Maurice Boyle, Chief Operations Officer at Logan Air. Today I'm in Stornoway in the beautiful Outer Hebrides to mark a momentous occasion as part of our Green Skies initiative. Come outside and let's take a look. I'm here with Ivor McLeod, Logan Air Station Supervisor and Ground Training Instructor. Now Logan Air's Green Skies initiative is to be carbon neutral by 2040. And the major plank of that is our multi-million pound investment in our new ATR fuel-efficient turboprop aircraft. But what people may not be aware of is we're investing over a million and a half pounds in all-electric ground equipment. And you'll see some of it behind us. Now, Ivor, what does it, the equipment mean for the customer and for the guys that work the, the planes here in, in Stornoway? Yeah, we're all very excited in Stornoway to have this new all-electric equipment. You're replacing the old, previous noisy, smoky diesel vehicles we had. Various items of kit are required to turn an aircraft around. So behind me, you can see two solar-powered avi ramps for the passengers. Next, we have the belt loader, which is used for taking bags and the mail on and off the aircraft in the morning and the afternoons. We also have two electric baggage trucks, and they are used now instead of our old diesel flatbed trucks. And last, we have our hybrid ground power units. So it's a much quieter, cleaner environment out here just now. What's the size of the Logan Air fleet? How many pieces of equipment are we rolling over from diesel to electric? So in the Highlands and Islands, we're approaching now 100 pieces of ground equipment. I'm glad to say we're all electric here in Stornoway and the other stations will follow suit. And we're actually saving over 70,000 litres of diesel in the Highland network per annum. So it's a big saving on diesel. Morris, that's a huge saving. That can't be ignored at all. So here we are, we're putting the concepts into action here with the first all-electric turnaround of an aircraft. Electric ground equipment, power units, baggage tractors, passenger steps, you name it. And our customers that are boarding this flight's more sustainable future hopefully will appreciate that their contribution and our contribution is to build a better environment for our communities. Now let's talk to Lee, who joined us recently as the newest member of the Logan Air team here in Stornoway. But more importantly, you're a member of the island community. What does Green Skies mean to you, Lee? It means a lot. From someone who's lived in the island for 23 years all my life and been part of Logan Air for two years now, it's great to see and it makes me proud to be part of the Logan Air team. So the combination of the new fuel-efficient aircraft silent electrical ground equipment. Do you think we're definitely on the right track on we're, this journey to green skies? It's a long road ahead, but we're well down it, so we will get there, and it's a good investment with good prospects. Wherever you're travelling this summer, we'd love you to join us and fly the greener skies with Logan Air.